scooped up by Viner, and that's sloppy though from Atkinson. Possession gifted to Tomin to use his some trickery to move away from Bristol City's number five early chance. And that's really riled up the Reading fans. It was Mate that came close. Bristol City though will have the goal kick. A lapse in concentration there from Rob Atkinson. Tom Ince and Junior Hoylett over this one, right on the edge of the box. Max O'Leary organising his three-man wall. Holmes and McIntyre are furthest forward. Interestingly, Holmes has just peeled off Rob Atkinson on this near side. Hoylett takes a flick on there, and Bristol City had to get ahead to it. Game plan for Bristol City today. It's the one that was successful at the Hawthorns, defending to do here. Hendrick, comfortable for O'Leary. In the end, he just casually fell down to his left-hand side. But Hendrick, the Republic of Ireland international, will feel as though he should have connected a bit better with that one. Brian Tinian in the away end today, in amongst all those Bristol City fans, making the trip up with his son Jay. Be lots of people posing for pictures with him. Here's Naki Wells, flag stays down initially. Eventually it does go up, forces a save out of Lumley. A one-man wall. Junior Hoylett is there. Alex Scott will take. Swung in towards the near post. Here's Semenyo. Can he fire at goal? And he's leaning back and he scuffs it in the end. His eyes must have lit up, but that was a big opportunity. He didn't have any Reading players in front of him. Yeah. Pretty long uh, managerial career so far. Two-time manager of the month as well. Spans back to 2006, where he first took charge of Macclesfield. Shot from range. My word, it was hit with real vigour. For a minute there, I thought I was going to see the net bulge. Yeah. Yeah, that was, um, I think that was quite close. We'll see now on the replay, but. Ince on set piece duty again. Inside the first seven minutes of the second half, nodded on, fired home, and Bristol City have invited that pressure on themselves. It's the uh, midfielder, Mamadou Loom, bags his first goal of the season, and his first goal for the club as well. Tim Closes totally unmarked at the far post, run from deeper, and it goes from James, players rise, Vyman closest to it. Scramble in there though, Rob Atkinson shoots, cries for a deflection off the Reading player, another chance wasted. Into the final 10 minutes. Andy King ready to come on. It's a nice little flick. Can it find Andy Vyman? A last gasp defending there, and another corner for the away side, but better again from the Reds. That's well played, looks good. Reading heading towards a valuable victory for them. Kept in by Shane Long, Bristol City too static. Chance for Jeff Hendrick, could double their lead here. Tom Ince fires at the legs of Max O'Leary, and the Royals are kept out. Scott once more, can he get a decent delivery into the box? Flicked on by Andy King. Mark Sykes desperate to keep the ball alive. Foot race between Long and Tim Closer. Long wins out. Will he go for goal here? Needs support. Shane Long to that far post. Andy Carroll fires home. And he completes a victory for Reading. Still coming up with the goals, age 33.